Hey, what's up everybody? Jeff Cross here. You can contact me at jeffcross22 at gmail.com. jeffcross22 at gmail.com. All right, well, I want to talk about something this week that's uh, been going on and um, I want to share it with you. So a few people have sent me texts over the year, you know, over the whole basketball season, but they've been coming in a little bit more over the last week, whether it be an email or a text or a, a phone call. And just, you know, saying thank you to me, you know, for posting videos and posting plays and um, doing all kinds of things. And, you know, they just said, oh, you know, thank you. I think you made me a better official or you made me a better person. And I appreciate what you the work you do. Well, that's that's cool. And I appreciate that. And um, anytime I can help, I want to be the first in line. I've always said that. So but um, this is what I want to say. We've heard the saying uh, uh, you can lead a horse to water, but you can't make him drink. Well, all I've done is show you where the water is and you guys are drinking. You guys are drinking the water. You know, I'm not the one. I put the play up. You guys are the one who are pressing play and watching the video. You guys are the one that is uh, is, is showing it in the locker room and talking about a pregame. You guys are the ones that are looking up the rules as, as I give you the rule reference and you verify it through the rule book. Um, you guys are the ones that are taking the quizzes. You guys are the ones that are watching the videos. I'm not doing it. I'm just showing you where it's at and reminding you what to do. So I just, I want you to remember your success and your growth and your development is not because of me. It's because of you. You are the one who has made, you taken advantage of those opportunities, whether it be video play or a a YouTube video. So you are the one take, give yourself some credit. Okay. Because when you fail, you're not going to say Jeff Cross made me fail. It's going to be your fault. So when you succeed, it is most definitely your doing. So remember that as you, as you finish up this last, whatever, a couple games that you might have, or if you're going into the postseason, it's you. Um, I heard something the other day. I didn't write it down, but I'm going to try and paraphrase it. Um, don't just give me the bread. Make me reach for the bread. You know, don't just uh, don't just give me the video. I got to make you reach for the video. And that's what you've done. I've put the video out there and I can't force you to look at it. And you went out there and opened it up and watched it. So um, as this as this season comes to an end, um, I want you to think about a couple things. I think it would be good if you could just make a mental note or write it down or do whatever you have to do to try and remember it. And and I want you to um, just, what was some of the downfalls of this season? You know, whatever that might be. And then I want you to think of some of the great things that happened this season. And remember those great things also, because you, I'm sure we've all had great successes over the season. even Even though it may not seem like much now, but in November or December, you had a great success and you got to really, really remember that. And the last thing I want you to, to think about and remember is, you know, I, I, was, I talk about regret a lot. I don't want to have any regrets. You know, I don't want to, you know, be in a nursing home and go, oh, I wish I would have. You know, I wish I would have done this or I wish I would have done that. I don't want to do that. So as you, um, we'll, we'll call it post game your season. As you're doing that, and uh, I want you to think about times where, yeah, I probably could have went and done that game, or I probably could have left myself open, or I probably could have um, uh, watched one more video. Think about those things that one more thing you could have done, but you decided not to for whatever reason, and see if maybe you could change that for next year. You know, we all have that. I probably could have not had that one extra French fry, or probably could have not had that one extra double cheeseburger. So, we, we all go through that, but um, remember that as, as you look back on your season and your successes, your failures, and what are some of the things that probably you could have done that you didn't. And if you can take that into the summer, into the next season, uh, you'll find yourself in a much better position come uh, September, October. So, all right, guys, that's all I got. I, I, I um, am looking forward to uh, hearing great stories from your postseason assignments or even finish up these last couple weeks. So remember, I appreciate the thank yous, but remember, you are the one drinking the water. You are the one press and play. Take credit for what you've done. Don't just give it out. You guys have made 
great strides in your officiating, and I don't want you to stop. So, all right, y'all. That's all I got for today. JeffCross22 at gmail.com. And by all means, remember to do this. Do hard things. Talk to y'all soon.